This is Baja SAE Shop Talk, the official podcast of the Baja SAE series. Scott! Yeah? What is that in the sky? I think it's a bird. It looks like a plane! No. It's, it's season two. two. Scott Schultz. Mike and Gracia. Good to be back. Great to be back. Should we catch up now or later? Later. Let's get to the news. Let's get to the news. Clean Snowmobile's next document submission for deadline is for the engineering design paper on January 23rd, followed by the engineering technical value benefit and sales PowerPoints due on January 31st. Formula IC Michigan has their ETC FMEA due January 9th, and both IC and EV Formula teams have their SES due January 10th. Aero Design East's first submission deadline is for the design report, 2D drawings, and technical data sheet on January 30th. Aero West doesn't really need to worry about those until March 6th. Baja's first document submission deadline is for the roll cage and written cost reduction report on February 16th for all Baja competitions. The new Kohler engines for the Baja team are available to purchase. Directions on how to purchase can be found on the Baja newsfeed. If there are any issues, you will need to contact the engine distributor directly at williamc at gardnerinc.com. This email can also be found in the description. For the 2023 Baja competition and future competitions, the first 25 teams through engine check being assigned tech numbers 1 through 25 will kick off the frame checks for day one of the competition. The complete guide and instructions for the process can be found online under series resources on BajaSAE.net. Hotel blocks are available for the formula and aero design competitions. Both hotel blocks can be found on each event's newsfeed and on SAE.org. It's never too early to start planning on where you're going to be staying. Just remember, failure to prepare is preparing to fail. Remember to add yourself to your team's fast track roster on SAE.org. You will need to do it to attend the competition, so might as well add yourself now. No time like the present. Teams can print participation certificates that prove they are participating in an SAE competition. Check the description for this episode for a link with directions on how to print that certificate. SAE has been adding new lectures to the Industrial Lecture Series program to help your team learn more outside of the classroom to give you a leg up on some competition. Some of the new lecturers are Dylan Knopp, Tim Droder, and Sarah Carter. I hope we got those names right. I do too. Anyway, if you are interested in having a lecture talk to your team, reach out to Rachel Wetzel at rachel.wetzel at sae.org. For a full list of the lecturers, visit the website in the description of this episode. SAE has revamped their mentorship program, which is great if you're looking for a mentor in the field that you are looking to get into after college. For more information about the program, follow the link in the description. So I have some exciting news, Mike. Exciting? Yeah. I'm hooked. Let me really in. SAE University programs will be launching new social media in the new year. Keep an eye out for our new Instagram and TikTok accounts to stay updated on all things CDS and university programs related. And of course, Mike. Of course. We're going to have some fun on those accounts, too. Who isn't ready to have fun? Hey, Scott. Hey, Mike. This season, you and I, we're looking to change and inspire. It is what we do. It's what we do. And in order to do that, we need to leave a message. What would that message be, Mike? That message would be difficult roads lead to beautiful destinations. Hmm, like Lake Tahoe. Like Lake Tahoe. Thanks for listening to Baja SAE Shop Talk. As always, we want to hear from you, so email BajaSAE at SAE.org. The show notes for this episode, as well as all others, can be found at www.BajaSAE.net slash podcast. Stay safe, and we'll catch you next episode.